Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. For most of us, figuring out what to eat after a long day can be challenging at times, I know for me. But not to worry, today we have Chef Cam teaching us how to battle our busy weeknights and how to feed your household in 30 minutes or, or less. less. Yes, child. How you doing, Miss Selena? You're looking good, good, baby. You know, I just got to tell you, what like. What is it that you're trying to see? You're looking real. I mean, Trying to see uh, the uh, salmon uh, in the uh, skin. Uh, okay, like, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> so today we're just yes. doing a fall version of, of salmon. You know, sometimes in different seasons, the preparation of the food can really help you, you know, get different yes. things across. So in this the fall, good for me. yeah, in the fall, what we like to focus on are foods that are high in like omega 3 yes. fatty acids. Yes. Because what those things do is they help fight against uh, things that are cancerous, right. that build up cells. That's so right. salmon right now would be the perfect thing for us to do if we're on the salmon diet, is a good trying time. to recover from uh, the season. It's the main meal it's so, my meal every day I eat salmon every single day in my so meal prep. what I so like to awesome. do is mix a little pink Himalayan salt okay do your um, thing got some black pepper right here okay and then we also have um, some fresh ground pink Himalayan mm -hmm. black pepper and a little bit of a, a salmon I call it seafood magic so there's that a, I've come there's up a with. pink Himalayan black pepper no it's a pink oh, Himalayan like salt and black now baby they have pink Himalayan black Okay. Oh, pink and black. Pink and then black. Then that would be a problem. Okay. But no. <laughs> so this is, I just call it seafood magic. It's just a, a combination oh, okay. of all so the things all the that stuff. I've gotten. Yep. So what I like to tell people to do is to pat the seasonings in mm. because a lot of people always want to know, oh, Cam, how do you keep how that you beautiful color right. and that beautiful sear? It's because I pat the seasonings in pat to make sure in. that we get that nice outside. Now, do, 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 when you put the seasonings on, yeah. is it better to let it marinate overnight? So if you do it, it overnight, is. okay. It's better because um, you want to take it out because anytime that you're doing salmon you want to serve you want to cook it at room temperature okay so instead oh, wow. of cooking it right out of the fridge and this is a little white grapeseed oil you guys oh, okay. you know I love, I love to use the I white grapeseed because it's really light on the cooking yes, it is. nice and juicy mm -hmm. and seared on the inside we want to go skin side down first skin because we want to get that fat that's right under that layer of the skin we want to get that activated so that flavor can begin to you know get into the food so mm -hmm. if you want to watch that for me mm -hmm. just just move it around just a little bit there we go perfect mm -hmm. right there okay I'm gonna move on to the Brussels sprouts okay so what the preparation of these Brussels sprouts are great because these are high in omega-3 mm -hmm. fatty acids as well. Right. But they're good for a fiber. Okay. So help you with your digestion, get yes. it nice and, and fluid. And you and know, Brussels sprouts are yeah. coming back. They are, they are making we a were comeback. Kids, we hated no, Brussels sprouts. No, no, nobody want to eat a, a handful of cabbage. No, they didn't want not, that. Not at the same time. You no, know, they're turning up. Take a couple leaves at a time, <laughs> but they really are turning up. Yeah. So what this process is called is blanching. Mm -hmm. So basically what we're going to do is put it in a pot of boiling water. Okay. And leave it in there for about two minutes. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take it out and saute it right up in, in the oh, same so skillet as so the get salmon. The get some of that flavor right onto My it. My God, So we, we only want to leave it on the skin for about a minute mm -hmm. and a half, and then we want to flip it to get flip that nice over. sear. Because I was ask. what we want to do is cook it to a perfect medium rare, right. because that's where you get all the flavor. You see how, how crispy that is? Right. You can actually almost eat that if you and would look, like to eat that skin. it's almost turning white. Yep. Uh -huh. even, and you would think that if it's cooking on the bottom that it's not going to cook through. No, 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 no. It, it'll definitely cook through. Okay. So this right here is nothing but a natural barrier uh -huh. that helps the fish from actually overcooking. Ah. That's why anytime I come down to the circle, I always cook the salmon with quick. the skin on uh -huh. because we want to keep that flavor. And so, chefs, when you come down, make sure you keep your skin on. Oh, see how you did the shout out to the other chefs. <laughs> make sure you keep your skin it on. It was low key shade, but it's cool. <laughs> Not um, also, because yeah. I, I have a time cooking salmon. Yes, my love. And I never really quite get it right. How do you keep it juicy? Uh huh. And how long does it take to saute it in the pan? So for, for it me, to be done? I start with the beginning. The white grapeseed oil is perfect for light cooking mm -hmm. and fast cooking. Okay. So for me, is I always start with the skin down, mm -hmm. and then when I flip it, I only cook it for two and a half minutes, and we're on about a minute and 45 seconds wow. right now. Okay. So people think that sometimes you cook salmon for five, six, 10, 12 minutes. Mm -hmm. That's absolutely ridiculous. Right. Because you're cooking all of the life and the juice and all that beautiful, you know, just that oh, good flavor. Oh, my salmon right be dead then. Yeah, no, yeah, okay. it's, it's a little dead. <laughs> so now we can actually begin to take just a couple of these Brussels sprouts right out of the, uh -huh. the boiling water, and I like to throw them right in the skillet, just like that. Okay, now Kim, before we eat this salmon, you yeah. know I got my eyes on this drink I over here. Do. I know you do. So <laughs> what, what time is it with these here drinks? So this right here is what I call, look how beautiful that, that is. That is just gorgeous. I call it That's the ridiculous. sparkling fall sangria. Okay, I'm going to put your Yeah, just, just grab me a couple of those brussels. So what we have in here is sangria, mm -hmm. apple cider, mm -hmm. fresh cinnamon sticks, mm -hmm. a little dash of cognac, 
Mm. Just because you know on the fall time you really want to relax. And you get a you warm inside. You want a hot girl summer. You, you're just tired. You need a, you need so a you cool need, girl you winter. Need, you need a, a cool, cool girl, girl winter. winter. So you put yeah. just a dash of cognac mm -hmm. in there, and you know it soothes you out for the night. Yes. So we can just on, begin lady. to pass these on to the ladies. I have yes. some tasters right Ooh, here. I love it. That are actually already ready. Oh, huh. I'm so I'm what I want you to do? Oh, I'll pass one to Miss. Yeah, of course. It's 500 episodes, baby. Yeah. Cheers to 500. I know. Cheers to 500, guys. Sorry, KD. <laughs> Salute! Mm. Yes! Mm. 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 That tastes like 500 oh, episodes, so don't good. it? Ooh. It does. Oh, my God! I don't know if that's a blessing or a sin, but Ooh, it's somewhere in between. Oh, my God! So, while you guys are doing that, he play too much. I'm going to keep shuffling and, and close my lead. Don't be careful, my love. I know, I want to die. So, we want to take those brushes. <laughs> Mm. This girl right here from Chicago, oh y'all, that's my sister right there, y'all. Mm. I just love her today. Oh Look at Jesus. So good. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. You, are, you know you always welcome here at the Sister Circle. For oh, more information on Chef Cam and his recipes, please follow him on Instagram at Cooking Cam.